Hi, everybody. How are you? We think we figured it out. All it took was a little uh, YouTube instruction of 41 seconds, right? But, but we don't know until we hear from you. So if you're on this, let us know down in the comments block uh, whether or not we are a landscape or you have to actually turn your phone or your PC sideways. No, I think we're doing well because look, the live is right up there. Really? And it's, it wasn't like that before? No, I don't believe so. Rookies. I don't know. What can we <laughs> say? But we came to you live earlier in a different way. And we hope it's the correct way this time. But we came to you uh, earlier uh, as we were talking about Albert Einstein and insaneness. So we're going to go ahead and repeat it. And if this one comes out okay, then we're going to delete our other Facebook Live. And we'll go with this one because this is landscape, not portrait. And we're both in the picture. Right. So that being said, um, so Albert Einstein, you know, is a great guy. Real smart dude, engineer. And um, I love Albert Einstein. If you follow me at all, you see that I occasionally post Albert Einstein quotes because he's very probably about daily smart. So yeah, he's yeah smart guy. So anyway, yeah, he describes insaneness in his own little way, which is uh, probably the the best description I've heard. But some people look at insaneness in, in other ways. They look at it, you know, uh, if uh, there's some poor homeless guy talking to the pigeons in the park, they think that's insane. If uh, someone is uh, jumping out of a flying airplane uh, for fun, they think that's insane. So there's different concepts or different ideas of what insaneness is. But Albert Einstein, he, he sets it this way. He looks at it like if you're doing uh, the same thing over and over again and expecting different results, that's insane. So, for example, if you looked at 2 plus 2 and you wanted to make it 5, but you kept doing 2 plus 2 over and over and over again, well, that's going to lead to insaneness. So, if you're a network marketer and you're doing the same things over and over and over again and not achieving the results that you would like, then that becomes kind of like a network marketing the same as kind of, correct so um, you know if you're if you're you know been doing this for two to five years and not getting where you want to be then you're definitely spinning those network wheels and not getting uh, the results that you want Lynn has a whole list of what I think are insane things that we're both guilty of that we've done over the years well it was told to us to do a certain blueprint which I believe at this point in time is antiquated and we have stumbled upon uh, the better way to do this uh, and I'm reluctant to say I've done this but I'm going to share what I've done because we've all done it and uh, here we go making a list of names make a list of 100 names post all over social media Bug your family and friends. Yikes. Message 10 new people daily. Gosh. Bug your family and friends again. More insaneness. Post more on social media. Crazy. Post more on social media and not generating results. Exactly. Beg your friends to attend a meeting so you don't go to your company's meeting by yourself. Get nervous because your list is starting to dry up. Or dwindle. Take a six-month break. How about that? How's that for your business? Take a six-month break. Is that going to help you? Don't you need to keep going full steam ahead? Get motivated again. Relaunch. See everybody else who's ranking up, winning amazing trips to great locations, and generating six, seven figures in income. What? And that's... Legit, folks, that's not, that is definitely happening. But act like everything is okay, running out of people to talk to. And what happens? You end up quitting because it's not working and you've become discouraged. And quitters never win and winners never quit. So, uh, if you're guilty of committing any of those things, as Lynn and I are, 
then uh, you haven't gotten much to show for it. But if you continue thinking it's a numbers game and you just need to talk to more people, that's insane. So. Insanity. With that being said, Lynn has stumbled on. Attraction marketing. Ignite and rapidly explode your business by attracting customers to you. Don't, no need to chase prospecting anymore. You get to where you need to get. You get to the audience that you need to meet. Correct, I mean, you're gonna, you're gonna want to uh, do something about it and start to attract high quality prospects. Recruit new people with ease and build the kind of business you've been dreaming about since you signed up with your company. So if you choose the latter, as I hope you do, then we can help you. Because we have a link either below us or above us that you just simply click on and you get a 10 day free boot camp on how to do this attraction marketing. Right, it's called the Attraction Marketing Formula. It is a boot camp for 10 days and it is free. If you want to explode, ignite, become a magnet to grow your business and get to the people that you want to attract, please do yourself a favor and click on the link, whether it's above or below. I'm not quite sure, but. Well, there is a link above and it'll be like a little fingerprint point looking things. And then below will be a learn more button. But remember, the choice is ultimately yours. So if you feel you're stagnant, if you feel that you gravitate or you uh, heard some of the information that we spoke about that you feel you're in the same rut, then uh, please click on it. I mean, you'll, you'll, you'll totally be enjoyed. So we hope that this Facebook Live brought you value. That is our goal, is to bring value every time we talk. Um, and give you insight into what we're doing and uh, Ignite your business right. through social media and internet marketing, the smart, new school tactic way. Boom. Traction Hopefully. marketing formula. Hopefully we're right. the right way. I think we are. So it's a football evening, Thursday night. It is. So I don't know who's playing. You said it was the Patriots. The Patriots and somebody. <laughs> Tom Brady and gang. I'm a Los Angeles Char Chargers fan, so Buffalo. Well, I'm from Buffalo. Yeah, I root for the Bills. But they're, they're yeah. by a week. Yeah. Oh. So, okay. I'm sure everybody's gonna be busy watching football shortly because that's what 70% of the household does these days. So Thursday night football, you know, why not? It's Thursday, Thursday. Everybody enjoy. Thank you again for watching and listening. I'm so glad that we figured out our portrait versus landscape mode. Thank you for listening. Click on Attraction Marketing Formula. Until next time, my name is Lynn. And I'm Will. And we'll see ya. And I'm we're Lynn and Will. And we'll see you soon. So like our page, peruse it. There's some good information on there to even uh, give you more information about what we've just spoke about. Go Albert Einstein. Peace right? out. That's right. See ya. Love you.